Over the years since 2006, when we first started selling e-bikes, we've sold a few bike models that clients have purchased to replace one of their cars, and none more so than the Turn GSD. It's been updated and now it's even better. Let's take a closer look. The Turn GSD version 2 still has the same versatility and robustness of the original, but there have been some changes that have improved the bike. If you want to get an idea of how versatile and robust this bike is, check out one of my earlier videos where I rode the original GSD to Australia's highest mountain with my wife as a passenger. The link's on the screen right now. I'll go through the improvements made to the second version of the GSD later in this video, but for those who aren't familiar with the bike, I'll introduce you to what the GSD is all about. At its core, the GSD is a bike that can have a maximum gross vehicle mass of 200 kilograms. What that means is that the total combined weight of the bike, including passengers, cargo, accessories, and the weight of the bike itself cannot exceed 200 kilograms. Now that's actually quite a lot for a bike. If you have seen the video that I referred to earlier, where I rode the GSD with my wife as a passenger up to Australia's highest mountain, the gross mass counting me, my wife, camera gear, accessories fitted to the bike, and the bike itself was 195 kilograms. So how can you use this bike in a practical sense? Well, I've sold GSDs to people for very different reasons and uses. I've had numerous families buy the bike with different seating combinations for carrying two children, such as with the clubhouse and yep seats. You can configure the GSD for carrying cargo, passengers, or both at the same time. So that's the bike at its core. The similarities between the previous model and this one are the overall shape and length of the bike. They haven't really changed much. The bikes have the same gross mass rating of 200 kilograms. They are both dual battery compatible and use hydraulic disc brakes front and rear. The key differences start with the motor. The available torque has been increased from 65 newton meters to 85 newton meters using Bosch's new cargo line motor. This gives the bike greater traction for moving those heavier loads or going up steeper hills. Suspension has been added to the front fork and some models come standard with a thud buster suspended seat post, giving even more comfort. Integrated lower decks are now standard on either side of the rear cargo rack. There are also two optional deck extensions available depending on your needs. An integrated wheel guard is now standard on the cargo rack to prevent passengers or cargo touching any moving parts. A full-size chain guard prevents long skirts and loose pants getting caught in the chain. The kickstand is now a heavy duty design with an automatic safety lock to keep the stand locked, making it safer for loading and unloading passengers or cargo. This eliminates the possibility that the kickstand will retract if the bike is accidentally pushed. The safety lockout for the stand is released via a handlebar mounted lever. A rear stop brake light is included on some models and activated when either brake lever is operated. In addition to the standard front and rear lights, some models are also equipped with a high beam and a low beam function on the headlights. Like the previous model, this bike is a one size fits most. It's able to be adjusted without the use of tools and the GSD can suit riders ranging in height from 150 to 195 centimeters or four foot 11 to six foot five inches. The geometry of this bike makes it super stable when riding and the low center of gravity makes it feel even more secure, especially for smaller riders. The step-through frame makes getting on and off easy. 
For security, a ring lock is attached to the front fork, which locks the front wheel and stops the bike from being able to be rolled away. You can also purchase an optional chain that plugs straight into the ring lock, which can be looped around something secure. The key for the ring lock is the same as the key for the battery, so it's one key for the whole bike. One of the really good things about Turn is that they design model-specific accessories that complement their bikes and maximise the utility of each bike. Let's have a look at the cargo options. There are so many options for cargo carrying that you can transform your GSD into the perfect machine just for you. There are cargo trays for the back and the front. There are side deck extensions for keeping cargo stable and secure. There are a host of bag and pannier options. There are extensions and stabilizers for the kickstand to provide even more stability when loading or unloading. And of course, there are pet carrying options. Let's now look at the passenger carrying options. The simplest seating option for the GSD is the Sidekick seat pad coupled with the Sidekick flat bars. For smaller children, you can fit up to two YEP seats or one YEP seat and one of the seat pads for a larger child. Another option for up to two children is the Clubhouse Plus, which can also fit one or two YEP seats. The Clubhouse Plus can also accommodate a Euro crate if you want to use it for cargo carrying. In the luxury department is the captain's chair. Coupled with the Sidekick Joyride bars, this seating arrangement for one person gives maximum comfort for a full-sized adult passenger. This arrangement can also fit a Euro crate if you want to double it up as a cargo carrier as well. The GSD comes standard with side decks but for added comfort and safety, you can add the side deck wide decks. If you are using the Clubhouse Plus for transporting children, you can add the Storm Box and top it off with the Storm Shield for complete weather protection for your children. Finally, let's have a look at some of the variations available. All variations of the GSD use the Bosch cargo line motor with 85 newton meters of torque and use the Bosch Purion slimline controller. They all have front suspension. The actual specifications for the GSD changes from time to time, but the current base gearing is a Shimano Dior 1x10 speed derailleur. The highest specification gearing found on the R14 model is a roll-off speed hub which features a 526% gear range, electronic shifting and automatic downshifting. This version comes with a Gates carbon belt drive which is silent, smooth and virtually maintenance free. All bikes are dual battery ready and are fitted with either a 400 or a 500 watt hour battery as standard. In terms of transport, you can fold the handlebar down and retract the seat and fit the GSD into the back of a medium-sized SUV. The rear rack is designed to allow the bike to be stored upright, taking up much less valuable floor space than a regular bike. The Turn GSD is an incredibly versatile bike. With its generous mass gross vehicle weight, this bike possibly could replace one of your cars and transport your cargo or passengers in safety and comfort. Turn offer a wide range of accessories that allow you to personalize and customize the GSD to suit your needs. And this bike is also versatile enough to fit most members of your family. So what are you waiting for? If you're interested in buying a GSD or you just want to find out a bit more, give me a call, send me an email or drop into our store. The address is below. You can also find out more about this bike on our website, the link is on the screen now. If you've liked this video, please hit the like, subscribe and bell icons to be notified of when we upload new videos. And don't forget to share this video with your friends. I'm Andrew from Foreman Design, thanks for watching.